In this video, we will show you how to use the Dollars Mocap Blender add-in to perform real-time facial and body motion capture in Blender using a webcam or video files. First, you'll need to download the latest version of Dollars Mono from the website. You can also download the Blender add-in from the bottom of the same page. Let's start by installing the add-in. Open Blender's Preferences, go to the Add-ons tab, click Install, and select the downloaded zip file. Enable the add-in by checking the box. Once activated, you'll see the Dollars Mocap add-in panel in Blender's sidebar. Next, let's look at how to perform facial capture using the add-in. You can check the model requirements on the Dollars Mocap documentation website. Here, we've opened a model with four separate facial meshes. In the add-ins mesh list, add four items, and select the corresponding mesh for each one. In the mono program, go to the option menu, open the stream tab, and check the option of blender streaming. Back in the add-in panel, click start listening. You should now see real-time facial capture results in blender. You can also click Start Recording to record the facial capture. After recording, click Stop Listening to disconnect from Mono. Now, you can replay the recorded results on the timeline. By selecting the mesh, you can also see the recorded keyframes. If your blend shapes aren't named according to the AR Kit convention, you can remap the names in the add-in. Now let's look at how to perform motion capture. Here, we import a model. In the armature section of the add-in, select the model's armature. Once selected, the add-in will automatically map the bones. You can review and manually adjust the mapping as needed. The add-in will also estimate the model's hip height, in meters, based on the hip bone. If this value doesn't match your actual model, you can adjust it manually. After confirming the bone mapping and hip height, click Start Listening to begin real-time motion capture. While capturing, Click Start Recording to save the animation as keyframes. Once you disconnect from Mono, you can replay the recorded animation. By selecting the model's armature, you'll see the recorded keyframes. Finally, if you've set up blend shape and bone mappings for your model, you can use these two buttons to export and import mapping configurations for future use. Before using the Blender add-in, we recommend browsing our documentation. You'll find a link in the video description.